please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask. But I never want them to have to experience loss like that again. You can't protect people, Joan. Not completely. Not anymore. <sighs> You're probably right. That doesn't mean we don't have to try. Max? What are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. Exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. I want to hear that from Javi. I don't have a problem with him. He's all right by me. Yeah. Same here. I don't buy it. Max, how did this start? Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? Answer her. I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. If you just asked, we'd have given it to you. That, that's not all. Rufus said Clementine ran his truck off the road just to break him free. We had real problems with her in the past. You can always judge a man by the company he keeps. Running with that girl don't look good. I would say not. Clementine's not a bad person, at least from what I've seen. Of course you'd say that. You got that honor among thieves. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to bandits. We're trying to build something different here. Oh, for God's sakes, get off your high horse. Don't pretend like your people don't have blood on their hands. I'm not sure what you mean. We hold our people to the highest standards. Javi? You have something to say? No. That's it. That's right. He knows what he done. There ain't nothing more to say. Uh, it's clear your brother doesn't belong here. Javi and his people have to go. You're overreacting. It was a scuffle over supplies. Uh, we've exiled people for less. Sorry, David. Your soldiers are already wild enough. We can't add more crazy to the mix. Take Javi and everyone in quarantine to the gate. Give them a pack with a bare minimum to survive. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here, your doctor friend too. But the rest of you, you're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. It's out of my hands. Just stay alive. <laughs> 